What's your name? My name is Mike Long. Okay, Mike Long. How old are you? I'm 12. Very good. Okay, let's go. As a first thing, I would like you to tell me something about yourself and specifically about your personality. What kind of person are you? Um, I really am a kind person. Okay, tell me why you are a kind person. Um, because I help people when they need. Okay. Another one, tell me three things that you are. You are a kind person, you are... I am a little bit selfish, I think so. It's a bit strange. Kind and selfish, why do you think that you're selfish? Because, um... I didn't get any like food. Okay, and? Mm, let me think. Mm, I think a lot, I talk a bit, a bit lot. Okay, you're a bit talkative. You're too talkative. Tell me why. Because I talk very really lot. Mm, mm, mm. Do people tell you that? Yes. Okay. Do they complain? No, just like joking. Okay, okay. So it's not too bad. Okay, so let's talk about food. Do you like food? Yes. Good. You said you never share food, so <laughs> it must be because you like it, right? So, um, uh, what do you eat when you're feeling down? I eat sweet or spicy. Spicy food. Why, why, why is that? Because uh, I feel very, like very happy when I eat spicy or sweet. Mm, right. What is the food that makes you happier? Mm, like ice cream. Mm -hmm. or what spicy food makes you happier? Mm, like chips, spicy chips. Mm, okay. Um, what about before you do sport? Do you do sport? Not really, really. Okay. When it happens, what do you eat before sport? Mm, I often go swimming on Wednesday, mm -hmm. and on Wednesday I eat some sausage or bread. Why? Because um, I don't buy it for me. Mm, okay, so there's no specific reason. Uh, what do you think it's good to eat before sport? Mm, my teacher said when I go swimming, we don't need to eat food because it will uh, harder to swim fast. So mm -hmm. I just eat because I'm hungry. Okay, right, right, right. Okay, so you think it's better just to drink when you go to swimming? Yes. Oh, that's the best. Okay, good. Uh, what about when you have an important test? Mm, I will eat nothing. Nothing. Okay. You, 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 won't, you won't feel like weak during the test if you eat nothing. Mm. Because when I have tests, I don't eat anything. Okay, why is that? Because the first reason that I don't have any food to eat, mm -hmm. and the next reason, like when I have exam, I don't feel like I want to eat. Okay, you're too nervous, maybe. Okay, to eat nothing. Wow. Okay. Um, what do you think it could be a good thing to eat before a test? Mm -hmm. Just a soft thing. Okay, for example? Um, like a candy. Hmm. Oh, okay, just a little bit if it's that. Okay. Let's talk about fast food, okay? Do, do you eat fast food? Yes. Okay. Do you think fast food is unhealthy? Yes, mm. because all the fast food that I eat have a lot of oil. Hmm, okay. Okay, uh, can you give me an example of fast food that you eat? Like chicken or pizza. Mm, okay. Uh, what's what is wrong with with uh, with uh, fast food? Can you say again? What's wrong with fast food? So if you eat fast food, what happens? Then it's not good. Will we have overweight? Mm -hmm. yes. You scared of that? Not really. Not really. But you don't do exercise. <laughs> okay. Okay. Do, do you know Facebook? Yes. Good. So. So nowadays, not only children are on Facebook, but also parents, right? Good. So, um, do you think children and parents should be friends on Facebook? I don't know, because I never am friends with my parents. Okay, and why don't you? Why are you scared of? Because my parents will see what I post in the Facebook or mm. so I don't like that. Okay, and uh, why do you think parents want to check 
What the children want to respond? They want to control our pets. I don't like that control. Mm-hmm. And what, what are they afraid of? What are parents afraid of? What might happen to Facebook with your parents? My parents just like afraid when some hacker hangs our Facebook or comments a bad thing with us. And what are the things that you do on Facebook that you don't, you wouldn't like your parents to see? Like post and put some strange caption. Mm-hmm. Well, that's my parents. Okay, good. Well done. So now I'm presenting you these situations. You just have to give me their reaction, real reaction, like as if we were in real life. Okay. So you go to school, you meet your teacher, and your teacher tells you you just failed your exam. No, no, just react. Don't tell me I think I will. Tell me the, the reaction. tells you my dog can open the door by itself. I don't believe that. Mm-hmm. Okay. And another friend tells you my grandmother has just bought a new Ferrari. Mm, that's good. Mm. <laughs> that's good. Okay. Okay. Last thing. Uh, you're telling me a story about an exciting experience. So think of the exciting experience, maybe not the most, but one of the most at least. Exciting experience you had in your past, be that uh, anything really, and uh, tell me a story of how it happened, when it happened, and so on. And please answer the questions and keep it loud, okay? Try. Yeah, yeah. You, you can you can talk about any experience that you had in the past as long as you find it uh, exciting, okay? A very nice experience, something that made you very happy. What can you think of? When is my birthday? Okay. Mm, my birthday is on. Okay. My birthday is on 18th June. Then last year in nine, like 2019, mm-hmm. I have a birthday at a restaurant with my grandparents and my parents. I told them to eat and they gave me presents that I really like. So tell me, what did you eat? What were the, pe- the presents? Mm, I eat some seafood on that restaurant and my parents give me a book and my idol album and the new shoes. What, why was that uh, a very exciting experience? Um, yes. Why what was that? Because it's my birthday and I uh, get to take a lot of presents. Mm-hmm. So really like okay. Thank you very much. Just to go